Hey. Hey. All right. So adding a fresh look to your home is easier than you think. Greg Lug, a florist and owner of the greenhouse in Hudson, is here to show us how to upcycle plants <laughs> from your yard into arrangements for inside your home. Yes. I just gave a big hug. I said, I'm sorry, I smell like a snake, but... <laughs> It's well, you go from <laughs> snakes to flowers, yes. right? So it's perfect. It all is full circle. Yeah, exactly. Right. How you, are you? You smell lovely. It's so good to have you back. It's good to see you. Yeah, you look, I said you, you look very smart with those glasses. Well, is it working? It is. <laughs> yeah. That's what, that's I, what have I was a, going I have for. a better, like, you know. Oh, my God. Do you uh, feel like you should? Yeah. Well, I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway, what did you bring? Oh, what did I bring? Well, what, I mean, what do you do? What am I looking for in my yard? Right? Where do I need to start? So I'll tell you what. People just don't realize what they have in their yard. They really don't. Like, people have so many beautiful things out there, leaves and grasses Weeds. and flowers, and bring, bring them in. Yep. Go to your shrub, cut them and bring them in. Bring that nature inside. This is the 4th of July weekend. Yeah. It's a perfect time for you guys to just really showcase and do some lovely things. And it just makes you feel better when you have fresh flowers in your house. Agreed. Right? Yes. So you do it. Okay. Just yes, do sir. it. Okay. So I'm gonna let's just start down here. Okay. We'll, we'll start with a bang, right? Okay. Boom. <laughs> Boom. Boom. Yeah. Fourth of July. Bang. <laughs> so, so we just thought it would be cute to have like a blue and white pot, right? Uh -huh. I mean, maybe you have a red pot, whatever. And these are just really cute. You know, these cute white daisies. Those are called crazy daisies. Okay. I don't know why they're called that. But we just put some American flags in there, That's and isn't that a cute arrangement? And I'll tell you what. Wait, if what you, are these? What are these are they? called uh, loosestrife. Loosestrife. Okay. Yeah. But um. Choose a container that is non-see-through. If you choose like a ceramic container or something that you can't see, there's a, you, have, you can do anything you want in there and you're not going to see through it. Yeah. And it's going to be more forgiving. Okay. Do you know what I mean? Because we don't really know what we're doing. You don't know what you're we're doing. We're not a professional like you, so we just <laughs> boom, boom, stick them in and then exactly. it, it look pretty. Exactly. So it's always great to just have maybe a bottle collection. That is so cute. And then maybe, just, maybe you just have like three or four blooming hydrangea in your yard, yeah. right? And you don't really have a big boom, right? So just, you know, just cut a few things. A still be, this is scabiosa, hosta leaves, you know, and hydrangea. It's just cute. If you have a few things, put it on down. It could be a cute centerpiece for your table. How do you make Entrance. it last in your house? Do I well, need to add some food? Well, you know, <laughs> you know, the funny thing is, is most people don't realize it's just about water. Oh. Like, just add water. That's it? Like, duh, right? Dirt. Yes. <laughs> so, okay. So just make sure the water level is high okay. every day. You have to water flowers every day, people. Did you hear that? Water flowers every day. Every day. Every day. No matter what flower. Every day. Every day. Every day. All right. All right. We're going to go. That's what I've been doing wrong. <laughs> We're going to go to this beautiful <laughs> pave design. Yep. So pave is a flat design. Okay. That's what pave means. Ooh. So this is really simple, I think, for anyone to do. Get a big flat box, whether it be a wooden tray or anything, you know, and just put oasis in it. You know, there's some span, there's some like Smithers Oasis oh, down yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we're just gonna plop flowers in there. This has hydrangea and lamb's ear and cone flower and some fennel. It's in hosta leaves. But isn't that a cool design? Uh, that's one of my favorites. Yeah, and you could just put that on a table, whatever entrance foyer or like a buffet table. And what if you don't have these in your yard? <laughs> <laughs> Go to your neighbor's yard? <laughs> I will them? be going to Megan. I'm coming to your yard. <laughs> yeah, just come on down to my shop. It'll be yeah, fine. Just go to him, seriously. So, All this right. is cute design. Anyone That's can cute. do it. I feel like and it's cute because it's, you know, a flat design. Yeah, I like that look. So, garden style, this footed vase, super cute. This is what all the brides are looking for, right? Just yeah. natural. This is like grapevine and, and snapdragons. And what does my little cheat That's sheet say? So pretty. Lemon verbena and some fern and some bachelor button, some sylvia and some sweet Did you light. say this word? <laughs> okay. <laughs> We got 30 seconds. Oh, What's no. the tall ones? Right, I so love me a, gr a grand, um, what do they call it? Just a grand entrance piece, that. whatever. Mm -hmm. So that, again, use a, use a ceramic vase. We just went to our shrub in the yard, and the pink hydrangeas are in full bloom right now. Go ahead and just don't be afraid to pull up. Just cut a bunch out. Yeah. And put it in a big vase. Uh, there's some uh, nine bark in there. That's this darker foliage that's okay. really cute. And some loose strife. So that makes a really grand statement. And again, Go out and just get a big selection. I just did hydrangeas this time on my deck. Good. The, the blue ones. Yeah, perfect. They're beautiful. Aren't they pretty? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The last one is just a really cool modern urn. I love that, that's that. a footed urn. And that's just fresh hosta leaves. You don't leaves. need color, just no, green. No, it's just greenery. So it's hosta leaves, it's some, some grasses, and some uh, sedum. It's just wow. all together in a big pot and call it a day. Don't quiz me on what you just said <laughs> for the last no, four minutes. No, exactly. But exactly. all of it's so pretty. Go down to your shop. 
The Everything is good. You're back to normal. Back to normal. Yeah. The green busy, house busy. in Hudson. Yeah. First in Maine. First in Maine. <laughs> do, 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 do. All right. Thank you. So good to see you. You're awesome. Great ideas. Good to see you.